Ace Money the name, getting paid for the game. My goal is to help you get that money by sharing my picks as well as some useful knowledge and betting techniques. Now, while we go over this recap, I'd like to get right into these picks so we can get in and out like a BE with handicappers. So it's a SBR, Sportsbook Robbery. Cheers. About them bills. About them this whole NFL first week, huh? F that. Ace money and sports book robbery. This is for WNBA. Uh, Tuesday, September 10th, 2024. We got uh, three games on the slate. Got three player props for you. Um, you get taken. Now that NFL started too, and uh, I feel like I'm back in my element. You know, I hate to, to say this about WNBA. Maybe it's just me, but I just feel like it's so up and down. You know, something could happen and the next day not happen. I mean, that's sports betting, but uh, someone averaged 20 shots, the next game shoot two, and this and that, and blah, blah, blah. But uh, just taking into consideration, playoffs are about to start. Uh, I think there's one spot open, everybody's clinched. So uh, the competition level might not be there right now especially getting into that fourth quarter. Uh, I feel like players are going to play to stay in shape and uh, obviously chemistry, everything else, but uh, just might not have that extra effort and everything else. But, uh, yeah, so, I, you know, I normally bet a lot more plays, but I just limited it down. So first up, uh, Bridget Carlton rebounds over three and a half. Uh, if you've been watching the channel, you know all year I've been betting her threes over two and a half, made, made good money. And then she started getting a little rocky his last two weeks. So uh, I started to fade it, missed it a couple times, hit it a couple times, as well as they brought the play down the books court up to it. And it used to be always plus 170. Now you find it at plus 110, plus 124. But uh, I've been playing at rebounds. Been messing around with this, too. Playing Atlanta. Atlanta overall, eighth to rebounds. Forward position ranked 10th. Mm -hmm. Atlanta's last two games went to OT. So then they only had one day's rest. So I'm putting that into consideration as well. Um. Last five games, she's hit this 100%. Last 20, 80%. For the year, 66%. And head to head, every time they played this year, she's went over this. And sometimes she don't, you know, she just gets four, but that's all we need is four. Uh, she plays plenty of minutes. She hangs out at the wing, shoots them threes, so uh, she'll cut in from the side, grabs offensive and defense. She's exceeded three and a half in five straight games on the road, averaging five. Bridget Carlton, let's get it. All right, next up, uh, Satu Sabli. Got Liberty at Dallas, 8 o'clock game. Uh, she was injured, came back during Olympic break. Shit, she was averaging three, four threes a game there, came back. She's only been playing in the WNBA since after the break, right after. And uh, decided to play her assist. Over four and a half, uh, minus 118 on FanDuel. It's, it's minus 135, DraftKings, so I always say, if you're new to the channel too, you got to have multiple books, always line shop, odd shop. That basically means find the lowest line, the best line, and the best odds coincide with that line. Uh, playing Liberty was pretty good against assists, third overall, sort of, uh, forward position and rank eighth. 
But uh, you got Satu, you got Enrique, you got uh, Segrist, uh, McCowan. You know, not much of a score, but she's been doing a little better. She's good for at least nine. Um, so they're vibing. They're getting, you know, they got a couple games on them belt now since after the break. But as you see, she's been going over this. Uh, Almost every game was a 7 out of 10. Uh, she has exceeded 4.5 assists, 5 of the last 6 games, averaging 5. Check out the head-to-head. -head. I think it's 2 out of 3. 1 out of 3. 94-93. Yeah. Just made me a little iffy on it. Uh, kind of depends on what decides to happen. You know, obviously. No shit, right? If, uh, if the players around here are on, she'll go over this. If they're missing, you know, she'll have the assist opportunities, but she won't clear it. You know, unfortunately, that's the way the game goes. Uh, she does pass the ball. Uh, she's good for 15 to 20 points. Uh, her threes, you could play over two and a half threes. She's good for. But I just felt like this was the best way to go at it. I feel like uh, Liberty got good defense. They're going to collapse on her, give her an opportunity to dish it, and hopefully Rika can hit a couple, of, you know, a couple jumpers or whatever. Uh, Fiend McCowan on the inside, stuff like that. Uh, hit someone on the three. But, uh, yeah, that's the way I'm going with it. Sensu Sabley assists so four and a half. All right, so uh, if you're still watching, hit that like button. New viewers, subscribe. Everyone turn your notifications on so you get all my plays, my live bets. Uh, it's sports, man. So info changes at a dime. Uh, drop it in the community. Try to get you ahead of it. Uh, I'm try to be as transparent as possible. Everything I do, I try to share with you um, different tips, techniques, different sports. Uh, NFL been doing real well, but um, I do appreciate everyone else. And. Uh, I said this a while ago, I've only been doing this a couple months with YouTube, but once I get to 500 subs, I'm going to do a $100 giveaway. Uh, I appreciate everyone who does like and comment. Comments help get the videos out there, too, as well as interaction and feedback. You know, uh, something you like, something you don't like. If you cash some bets, if you didn't, you're fucking mad. But uh, I'm a sports better. I do place all these bets I give you. Uh Appreciate everyone. Brianna Jones, she been killing it. She got moved to the starting lineup uh, about a week or two ago. Points over 14 and a half. As I was just saying about dropping shit in the community, I dropped these plays last night. It takes me time to make these videos and stuff. Um, I dropped it at 15 and a half. I played it at 15 and a half. They didn't have 14 and a half. Always play the lowest number you can. If you're betting more money, Always all, all line it back, get a lower number. If you ever notice, the sports books are always right on. You either win by a little or lose by a little. Uh, for instance, fucking Monday Night Football, uh, Kittle all lined it back to 40 plus. Man got 40 yards. Instead of instead of playing it at like one thirty eight or some shit for like forty two yards, played it at one fifty five. And the amount I bet it's only a two three dollar difference on a win. And uh, and I said it, it's gonna you know always get it back. It could be the difference between a win or a lose. So hopefully you don't just look at the plays and fast forward to the captions with the plays and you actually listen to what I'm saying. Uh. She got moved to the starting lineup over here. 
and she's been going off. Uh, uh, we played her the last couple games. I'm going to continue to play it. If they, they got Mabry and a couple people since the trade deadline. I think it was might have been just Mabry. It could have been someone else, too. Now they found a spot for her. She's coming off the bench, and uh, she's been hit or miss. She's like the oh yeah, Mabry, but uh, they've been feeding Jones. She's healthy. Uh, she's been a beast, and uh, playing Los Angeles, ten plays and points allowed. Uh, does get worse to the forward position, but uh, she should go over this no problem. She's been counted by ten points almost. Uh, Seattle got a good defense, played them twice, easily cleared it. Played Vegas, which allows a lot of points, and they just played Los Angeles, which he had 21 points. Uh, you could look at Rikia's, you know, she's been hitting her number, but they kept raising her number. Been playing Rikia all year before she was the cool thing to do. But uh, her number's kind of high, and... Uh, I'd just rather pass it. But uh, I appreciate everyone. Let's get that money. Ain't some money to name, getting paid for the game. Let's go. Like, subscribe, comment. <laughs>